Crackberry.com. Hey everyone, DJ here for Crackberry.com, and um, today we're looking at a website that is, um, if a temporary fix only, looking to help any BlackBerry 10 users out there install files OTA. It's called uh, Barnstall. Dot com and uh, so like I said you'll know if you have a BlackBerry 10 phone it is um, there isn't really any way to install OTA except through um, BlackBerry World and so bar install which is currently in beta um, aims to um, get you installing OTA um, you do need to sign up for an account and a, a premium account at that um, well, I'll talk a bit about that later. I'm just going to go through the, um, and show you the process of installing online. Um, when you sign up for your account and you're all set up with a um, premium account, you have to set up a, a VPN on your device. Um, all the settings for that will be provided um, once you set everything up on the site. Um, you have to add your devices. Um, you can add up to two devices um, and each device has a slightly different setting in device ID if anything um, it, everything else is kind of the same but the small differences are in the specific device details um, so you have to set all of that up and then whenever you want to install anything um, OTA you've got to remember to uh, turn on connect to the VPN um, let me just show you here um, these are some bar files that I've uploaded. Any bar files you want to install OTA, you have to upload to the site. Um, and then it will install from there. Uh, you can see right here, beside each of these ones that I've uploaded is NA. And that's because I've logged onto the site before actually connecting to um, the VPN. But if I connect to that right now... always takes longer when you are actually doing a demo right um, done and then I'll just refresh um, the page here and you'll see uh, an install button becomes available um, you also mustn't forget to turn on development mode now, I've turned that on already um, but if you do forget to turn on um, development mode uh, oh no it's cleared um, you do get an error um, you have a progress bit that squeezes in here um, when when you're uh, when you're installing things, um, and that kind of stays there until you manually clear that up. Um, but you do get errors if you haven't got development mode, development mode turned on or any other sort of um, issues that you come across. Um, so I'm going to install Craig's feed here um, and just do it. So like I said, you have to upload them um, to the website before you can install. You can do this from your your the browser. Um, on your phone or even on the laptop and then install them on the go and you can see there I've got a progress section now um, this is something I did earlier and I forgot to turn on development mode um, but here we go um, it's installing um, I get variating speeds depending on my time of day obviously with the Wi-Fi connection or um, but installs not it doesn't it's about the same as if I did it through my laptop through the Chrome plugin which I, I love to use. Um but we'll just wait for this to install and there it's done. So if I just go to my home screen and there it is all installed. Um so yeah you can see uh, it's quick and easy. We there's a lot of setting up to do at the beginning. Now, I did say that you need a premium account in order to do this. Now, the premium account is $2.99 a month in order to do this. It's, it's again, access to the VPN um, server. Um, and so it's $2.99. Um, the um, owner of the website has does give you a kind of three-day trial, but it does mean you have to give your payment details right at the start um, but um, within the three days if you cancel you get a full refund and and you're not um, and and that's it um, there is a free account available but there's no VPN um, access with a free account all you can do is kind of upload your bar files if you wanted to just maybe store some bar files um, that um, 
isn't is the option for a free account but you only get 256 megabytes um, available for that with a premium account you have 8 gig of, of space to upload files um, but so who does it benefit if it's going to be $2.99 um, I think for myself being a blogger and I review uh, a lot of apps um, and I, I beta test as well um, it's quite useful for me to have something like this because you get sent the bar files through email um, instead of me having to plug into or use my um, laptop especially if I'm out on the go I can uh, install it while I'm away I don't have to wait until I get home and then connect um, to my machine I can do it um, while I'm out and, and give the app a try almost straight away so it's definitely something I'd find useful for myself maybe beta beta testers if you do test a lot of the a lot of apps for BlackBerry 10 you're going to be provided with the bar file so it's probably going to be useful um, but you can cancel at any time there's no kind of um, length of time you have to subscribe for so um, it's something that you can cancel at any time uh, that's one of the main features of a premium account um, you can see here this APK file section it's cause you can convert APK files as well if, if you wanted to but the main thing is bar install I mean the website is called bar install and, and that's what the premium account gives you uh, one thing though uh, if you are running um, OS version 10.1.0.4 etc. Uh, you won't be able to use this and if you are running 10.2 you also won't be able to use this so it is somewhat of a temporary fix for now um, so if you, you aren't running any of the latest leaks and you want to give it a try it's something that you can um, trial uh, but like I said you do have to um, give payment details when you sign up but if you cancel within the first three days then uh, it's a full refund. Uh, that's barnstall.com um, you can give it a try, I've certainly found it useful um, so I can upload kind of on the go um, but yeah, check it out, barinstall.com